In this video, we are going to open up a budget UV printer and look at what is inside. This model is sold under multiple brands including ACHI and Aerosmart. It uses parts from an Epson printer with the DX5 print head. There are four panels that are easily removed. Make sure the printer is unplugged before removing the panels. Be particularly careful with the top of the panel of this model, as one of the control boards is attached to it. The first thing to notice is the cooling system. UV printing is more demanding on the print head than a regular inkjet printer. The water pump activates at the same time as the UV light during printing. It circulates water through the tubes to the print head and through a fan to provide a very basic cooling system. Without this, the head might get too hot, which would damage the head electronics. Ink moves from the containers to the print head via these eight tubes to the dampers connected to the print head. It looks like it relies on capillary action and must be primed with a syringe when new ink is added. The white ink has a couple of additional tubes connected to agitate the ink. White ink contains titanium dioxide, the same as correction fluid, which can easily block the nozzles. On this printer, the pump only agitates the ink while the printer is in operation. This reduces risk of problems, but requires constant use and does not agitate the ink already in the tubes. More expensive printers have a better system for agitating the white ink. When performing a cleaning cycle, the head moves to the far right and the ink is released. This waste ink travels through these waste tubes to the waste ink collection bottle. On this printer, using the cleaning cycle does not seem to be enough, and cleaning solution must be forced through the print head to reduce white ink from clogging the heads. The UV printer uses modified control boards from an Epson printer to perform most of the control logic. One thing to note on this printer is that although it has an emergency stop button, that button actually doesn't do anything. I hope the inside look of our budget UV printer was useful for you. Please leave comments letting us know what you'd like to see next.